Today I'm going to be giving you a shooting workout based around Damian Lillard. The majority of this workout is footwork based, but we'll also go over some coverages and reads and when to use these footworks. I think when it comes down to game application and a lot of this stuff is just natural reads, but you have to practice something habitually to make it a habit. And yes, by the way, this workout does provide game results. Launch is a tough three -pointer. Now you can do all of these footworks and all these drills out of the mid-range and I would probably recommend that if you have the time but today we're just going to keep it to the three-pointers as this range is typically when Damian Lillard has the most amount of spacing to do these moves and hit these shots. So to begin with we're just going to start with our typical inside out footwork meaning that if you're dribbling left your footwork should be right left and if you're dribbling right your footwork should be left right. You see Damian Lillard do this pretty consistently and it's probably the easiest footwork to get to. You're going to want to make 10 reps going each way. Make sure you find your back balance before you go up and get those feet popping into place, you should be able to hear your sneakers squeak before you go up into the air. Coming up next, we got our single leg foot replacement where you're hopping off that inside foot and landing on two before going up into your shot. Here's another in-game example of Damian Lillard doing this exact same footwork and showing how effective it is. It's a quick way to get off the ground. Once again, you're going to want to make 10 of these going each way and focus on exploding up once you hit that pogo stick. Coming up next, we're going to go back to our inside out footwork that we did in the first drill. But this time, you're going to add a pump fake, regather yourself, and then go back up into your shot. Now, this is going to allow you a little bit more time to really pay attention to your feet. Also, your ball path on your shot line. Make sure that it's smooth and upright. A lot of times when you're shooting from further away, and especially in this drill when you're having to focus on footwork, that part of your shot can get sloppy. So when you're making 10 going both ways, just really focus on keeping your fluidity once it's time to actually go up into your shot and hold that follow through strong. Now, as you could probably imagine, we're going to go back to our single leg foot replacement, add a pump fake, and then go up and shoot. Same rules as before, just really focus on your footwork, and then hold that follow through strong up top. Doing a drill like this is really going to actually show you how unbalanced you are a lot of the time when you're going up to shoot, so focus on gathering yourself as much as possible. I think of it like shooting a gun. You want as little recoil as possible, and the same thing on your footwork before you go up into your shot. Coming up next, we got a pretty common footwork. It's just going to be a normal step back. So you're punching hard off that inside foot and then getting back onto two. You see Damian Lillard do this pretty consistently, not necessarily out of a pick and roll situation, but it's a super effective and easy scoring move, especially when you pound that dribble as hard as you can going up into your shot. Think shotgun blast when you're dribbling that ball down. Make 10 again going both ways. Last but not least, we got our punch drag. This is a super violent and super effective move if done correctly. A couple of the keys to this are making sure you're low and to test ourselves to make sure that we're low, we're touching the ground during the drill. As you can see right here by this in-game example, dipping this shoulder makes the defender have to respect your drive, but it also allows you to build up a lot of explosiveness to get that separation. Make 10 going both ways, and then that is going to be your Damian Lillard shooting workout. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button, but as always, thank you guys so much for the support, and we'll be back soon.